when I say, well, honestly, Lord, I'm just sad because of this, 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 and this. And once it's out, then I can say, and I'm also grateful for this. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And then that he has come around on both sides because he cares about what's bothering me. Mm -hmm. And he responds to Thanksgiving and then he's guarded me and all of a sudden I have peace. And so I take Mm -hmm. that scripture quite literally. Yeah. Um, in my actions that's and that's yeah. it it works i promise you it works Beautiful. the word works like you said the word, the word. Yes. works meditating on god's word like what does that look like for each of you as far as meditating can on i god's be word? super transparent yes yeah. please <laughs> so um you know 2020 was a big year and it was a big year of idols being exposed mm-hmm. it was a big year of you know, us having to deal with the lives that we actually live um, as individuals, as communities, as regions, as nations, Mm -hmm. as the world. And so one of the big themes of that year, um, I had to do a lot with racism, right? Mm -hmm. And so everybody was aware after watching George Floyd be murdered, everybody was aware of racism together in a moment. And so I do diversity training and I have these conversations as a side job from singing and speaking anyway, (laughs) but um, the Lord was asking me to have these conversations and they've been amazing conversations where the Lord is in the midst because we use the Bible and we use the Bible. (laughs) But one of the things I've noticed is I have had to meditate differently in order to keep my heart pure Mm. because the world is not changing. So it's, there's this tension of things are happening in the world that are not lovely, that are not pure, that are not just right. Mm -hmm. And what do we do about that? Mm -hmm. Especially when we consider people around the world who may experience even less of the lovely, even less of the pure, even less of the just. What is the Lord asking us to do and why? Yeah. And it there has been just this journey of even this morning, like I was just telling our producer, my husband is on a flight and he's on a middle seat next to a man who said, who texted the most horrible thing mm-hmm. about him as a black man. I have to sit next to this, imagine all the things and beyond. And he texted me this and I'm like, you have to sit next to him for four hours. That's not lovely. Wow. That's not oh, pure. No. That's not just. Mm. And still, I believe that even in this skin, the promises of God are true. And so how do I reconcile those tensions where this is happening in real time? That's a real event. That's a real circumstance. And right now, My husband is made in the image of God. I am made in the image of God. Our value, our dignity, our worth is intact and never changeable based on what any man says. And so it really does come down to the disciplines of how you meditate and realizing that it's so, (laughs) it it really, and, and I really want people to watch and to pay attention because it's easy for us to go one way or the other to say that either it's not true, just come on past it. Yeah. He's crazy. Don't mind him. Mm-hmm. But he's sitting next to him yeah, for four right. hours yeah. Yeah. with that heat, that that yes. hatred, that energy, yeah. Yeah. that atmosphere yeah. seething, right? So it is real. But at the same time, God is real. <laughs> yes. yes. And who God says we are is yes. more real. And that's where I have to choose to meditate. Yes. And it doesn't mean that that doesn't get addressed, but it does mean that yes. in this moment, I can choose, my husband can choose to think of what's lovely, yeah. yes. to think of what's wow. pure. And then he told me, actually, I I feel sorry for this man yeah. walking around with so much hate. Like if you have it at the ready, you're carrying it. Yeah. Right. Uh, yeah. Like yeah. I just said, excuse me, is that seat taken? <laughs> <laughs> and you came with the, <laughs> you know, it's like, you just had it tucked yeah. in like wow. that has to that's decaying death yes. Yes. horribleness yes. Yeah. and you had it ready and so I sell that to say I I want people to know who are watching and who are sitting with us yeah. in the word that it doesn't mean that everything is lovely yes. it does not mean that everything is pure or just mm-hmm. but it does mean that we are citizens of a kingdom that's right 
that is real yeah. and that is here. Yeah. Right. Come on. It doesn't mean that where we live isn't where we live, but we are still citizens of a different kingdom yes. Yes. and we get to be those citizens yeah. at all times, yes. regardless yes. of who we're near, what happens. Yeah. It is the meditating and it is the choosing to focus in on what God says about me. Even as I go, like Isaiah 1, 16 and 17 says, to correct oppression. Yes. I'm not, I don't have to let that seep in no. because of how I meditate. And wow. I really want people to get that. Yeah. Like, that's how it plays out in my life is this constant tension of, ooh, I've got to let the Lord speak to this. Yes. And I've got to do the disciplines in order mm -hmm. for him to do that. Yeah. I've got to go first yeah. to, into his presence. I've got to say, Holy Spirit, be near yeah. first. Yeah. Cool. Or I could, in not praying, get up, go to an early flight. And that's the first thing I see about myself. Mm -hmm. yeah. Can you yeah. imagine? Yeah. yeah. Waiting, ready. No. Yep. And so we've got yeah. to focus in on the Holy Spirit and get our minds mm -hmm. renewed That's good. so yes. that that negative thinking is pushed out. Any thinking outside of being rooted in who we are in Christ is stinking thinking. Come and on. I promise you, it <laughs> leads to somewhere foul. It does. Yes. It just yeah. does. Yes. And we have the choice. We have the choice, even when we were surrounded by the unlovely, the yeah. un impure yes. and the unjust yeah. to focus on the lovely, the pure and the just. Be anxious for nothing, mm -hmm. but in everything by prayer mm -hmm. and supplication with thanksgiving, mm -hmm. let your requests be made known to God yeah. and the peace of God, mm -hmm. which surpasses all understanding, yeah. will guard your hearts and your minds through Christ Jesus. Come on, yeah. And yeah. in this idea of negative thinking, there can actually be a, be a guard that we put over our yeah. minds, that mm -hmm. we allow God to guard our minds yeah. with, and that's his peace. Yes, yeah. right. And how have you experienced that, that peace guarding your minds? I take that scripture as a, as a prescription. It is because I don't hear the Lord saying, don't be anxious for anything. Mm -hmm. I hear him saying, Oh no, 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 don't be anxious for anything. Yeah. And yeah. in that yeah. he says with Thanksgiving, yeah. make your requests known. Mm -hmm. And so even back to what I was discussing earlier, even when things aren't lovely or pure or just, and, and they are things that would cause anxiety, would cause you to peer in and feel like you have to take care of yourself. He says, the prescription is you can grieve those things, yes. making your requests known to me and with gratitude. Mm -hmm. And something about that pair really brings out such an authentic and honest conversation for me yeah. with the Lord. When I say, well, honestly, Lord, I'm just sad because of this, this, this and this. Yeah. And once it's out, then I can say, and I'm also grateful for this. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And then wow. that he has come around on both sides because he cares about what's bothering me. Mm -hmm. And he responds to Thanksgiving and then he's guarded me and all of a sudden I have peace. And so I take mm -hmm. that scripture quite literally yeah. um, in my actions. That's and that's, yeah. it, it works. I promise you it works. Beautiful. The word works. Like you said, the word, the word, the word yes. works. works. The word Thank you for works. sharing that. That's mm -hmm. so helpful. I just imagine that's, yeah. those are tools that mm -hmm. ladies at home can, can take yeah. and write down and truly mm -hmm. put that prescription into use. Yeah. I think it helps to remember that peace Peace passes understanding, yeah. mm -hmm. but it doesn't feel like worldly comfort. Mm -hmm. um, I can't remember the reference of the psalm, but it says, yeah. you keep him in perfect peace, him whose mind is steadfast because he trusts in you. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You keep yeah. him in perfect peace. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. And I love that that verse. And sometimes when I'm feeling anxious, mm -hmm. it's, it's one of the only ones that my mind can recall. And I'll just say it slowly. You keep mm -hmm. him in perfect peace. Mm -hmm. Him whose mind is steadfast because mm -hmm. he trusts in you. Yes. But we can't experience peace until we experience chaos. At TBN, our mission is to use every available means to reach as many individuals and families as possible with the life-changing gospel of Jesus Christ. Thank you for helping make the gospel of grace go around the world. And it's because of you that partner with us that this ministry continues. God bless you.